What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Hey, I bought this backpack, and the reason I bought this backpack is that it actually qualifies by dimensions as a personal item, and it, the personal item uh, size is very a little bit by airline, but uh, it's basically day pack size. It's actually pretty small. It uh, depends on the airline that you're flying on, so definitely check that out, but this one seemed to kind of match both of the airlines that I was flying on, and so I don't have to worry about not being able to take on my personal item or having my personal item count as my carry-on which is a little bit bigger as you can see a pretty nice looking uh, backpack here it's got kind of this uh almost houndstooth kind of gray and black and uh, white material it's pretty smooth it's not like a heavy canvas but it definitely feels robust and this mateen backpack also expands here so it should hold a pretty good amount of things and there's a number of things that I really liked it liked about it and uh, were, were the reasons that I picked it up. But let me show you, let me just kind of go through and see what it all has. We do have a pocket on the front, goes down all the way here, zippered right there, so easy access to things on the outside. It does expand a little bit there. And then on this side, we also have another zipper to kind of get in this inner pocket. There's another inner pocket right here behind this bigger pocket. Yeah, that's true separate pocket wow so there's lots of places to get headphones things like that that you might need then we have this zipper which is a dual zipper all the way around to get into this front uh, outside pocket we have a keychain clip right here so and this is detachable it looks like so if I pull that out you can put your keys on this key ring clip it right there and it's gonna be nice and secure that's actually pretty clever for being able to get them really quickly you know if you or parking your car at a trailhead or something like that and want to clip them in there so they don't fall out. So that's pretty nice that that is there. We have a little mesh pocket right here for ID, maybe money, those types of things. We have two pen holders right there in a kind of a narrow pocket and then a pocket behind this mesh pocket as well. And this whole front um, cavernous area here would be perfect for full size headphones, even water bottles and the like. Speaking of water bottles, we do have a mesh pocket on the side which will probably be only good for like the bottled water because it's not they aren't huge you know I'll say you know they are pretty big you might be able to squeeze something in here but like the the, the standard Aquafina bottles is probably gonna be about as big as I would probably recommend for it. like an Nalgene is just gonna be a little too big in my opinion then as you can see here that takes care of this front third but in the middle here we have a much bigger larger pocket opens up like this we have a pocket on the, the flap itself, and then we have, um, you know, a nice uh, nylon lining, black all over here. And then we have two mesh pockets down here, and then we use, you might be able to see here, we have a USB cord. And this is basically, I think, it's a, basically a USB extension cord. So you can plug this into, you know, a power bank, and then on this side, you have this little plastic blister here with another USB cord. So you could plug in your phone or your tablet or whatever and get power from your power bank which is going to be inside you don't have to dig it out you can just plug it in there which is pretty cool and if you have like a little retractable one you could leave it hanging there and uh, plug it in so pretty clever definitely tech minded kind of modern minded we have a nice big grab handle on the top here as you might be able to see this it has uh, that breathable nylon mesh underneath and this is really robust I mean it's really thick and comfortable so it's a nice big handle and then if we open up the main, or I, I don't know if I'll call it the main, but I'll call it the laptop pocket here, is the, the last one is we have, you know, a pretty big pocket here, but the, the laptop is supposed to slide into this insulated pocket, or this padded pocket right here. We have a strap that goes over it. We have a sleeve right here, which would be perfect for papers. Um, and I do love that. I do love the separate laptop pockets, especially when you do have a laptop. You have a loop up here to hang it and then on the back this is really where you know the features started getting more important to me we have two padded shoulder straps which are pretty nicely padded particularly for a day pack adjustable on the bottom but as you might be able to see here uh, we also have padding up here as well as a piece of padding down here but this is also a zippered pocket so you could put some stuff right down here it's not it's not that large but uh, you could definitely throw some things in there. But this strap right here is what sold me. And I don't know why more backpacks don't have this strap or a padded bottom here that is only attached on the sides because this allows you to kind of put it over 
the retractable handle on your carry-on luggage. And that's, you know, maybe not as important on the backpack because you can throw it on, but there's a lot of times I just don't want to have my backpack on. I want to slide it over the handle of my carry-on and this will make sure that it's not falling off. I don't lose it. And so this little strap here, while it might seem pretty minor, is always, always a big feature for me. So I really like this thing. It wasn't that expensive, uh, you know, because I'm kind of cheap. It was in the $30 range. So if you want something that's going to, by dimensions, fit missiles, personal items for most airlines, this is what you're going to want. You know this or something like it so i'll put a link to it in the description because i think this is going to get a lot of stuff on the airplane it's nice nice looking um and you're going to have a little peace of mind especially when you're traveling so check it out peter Monpanda out <laughs>